Hi there, how are we all doing today? We've got the new Renegy Smart Lithium Pro Lithium Phosphate, should I say, Pro battery here. It's an IPA rating as well. So this is the box, so I'll, uh, it's like quite big. So, We'll have a go at getting out on camera, but I am limited to room here on my work table. Straight out of the box, we've got the literature, a few stickers, Renegy stickers. So just bear with me while I uh, take it out. So we've got the all the packing. And the bolts. Oh yes, I've got the box. So here we have. The new, look at that, I think it's a bit smaller than the other ones as well, yeah. Just looking what I've got in the, uh, in the van at the moment, these are, a, it's a quite a little smaller dimension. So look at that, got two lots of plugs, a, a long one and short one, we'll zoom in a bit. Positive and negative. So one, the thing with this um, battery is, as I was reading, it has a 250 amp surge. So hopefully it'll get my coffee machine working. 30 seconds it'll run 250 amps and then it'll just go down to 100 amps capacity um it's a 100 amp hour 12.8 volt it's got some little carrying handles here it is got an ipa as well rating 10 year lifespan bluetooth heated and it's a lot more efficient than their older ones what were heated So, this is my first heated one. I don't know if it'll come straight onto me app. So, but uh, I've got my older phone here. It'll probably need uh, spring into life. So, this is the uh, Renergy app. So, at the moment, Pick one battery up, it's picked the solar generator up, the rover, it's picked my other battery up. I don't know why it wasn't equalizing because or charging it off, it's all wired properly, but that wired up. But anyway, it hasn't, it's not come alive yet, anyway. So we'll uh, we'll make it come alive by usually you can even do it with a nine volt battery. Put a 9 volt battery or anything on just well, so it just wakes it up so it's got a bit of charge to it. Uh, oh, just looking there, operating temperature minus 20, mi minus 50. That must be because of the heat heater in it. Uh, And that is it minus 20 to plus 20 possibly I mean plus 50 and that would be more appropriate I know it has um, all safety cut off things don't think I've got a 9 volt battery I 
anything uh, it's come up and this is on the app the statistics maximum capacity as you can see operation temperatures it's been in now so uh, and then the cells at the bottom So as you go back to the app, as you can see that's that that's this one. There me two house batteries and uh, that's me rover solar power. You can see but I'll be using this in a different vehicle in my works van and it's just so I can hopefully use the coffee machine with that um, 250 amp quick burst for 30 seconds. So that'll um, get our stuff going. And then if I'm going on a weekend away, I might um, connect this up to my batteries, house batteries here in the uh, my bigger my bigger van. As you can see, it's a nice looking actually uh, case. Feels very strong, like I say, it is water resistant. Uh, it's the Smart Pro. It's got a very good BMS on it. Um, it might, the actual booklet shows you everything what you want to know. not tiny writing or anything everything's all displayed lovely as mounting brackets at the bottom as well you can use like this this in the, like on boats as well as RVs well you can use it for multiple things go-karts quite a few things golf carts should I say there's a umpteen applications you can use this for so yeah that is the smart energy battery i'll be doing some tests to see if it'll do the coffee machine when i um put it all in and that's it like i say it's quite a bit smaller than the other this is the uh samsung ultra so it's only just a bit taller than that and the uh, width as well that's what i'm pleased with all right thanks for watching please like and subscribe um there's some other energy stuff on my channel as well and uh thanks for watching goodbye